Sure. My name is Bruce Assad, A-S-S-A-D. I'm the special chef of Bristol County. And what can you tell us today regarding Michelle Carter's stay? Is she here already? Yes, she is. She's gone through the booking process. Uh, she's being evaluated by both our medical and mental health teams, as we do with everyone that it comes into uh, Bristol County. Uh, and right now, she's in that process right now. And tell us a little bit about what her situation will be like here. Well, she'll be uh, housed in the uh, the medical unit at the present time, it will be an eyeball watch one-on-one uh, -on -one, uh, for the present time based on, on age, the circumstances, and the high-profile nature of the case. And when, I guess, can you give me more information about that? So someone's literally watching her the entire time? That's correct. That is absolutely correct. Uh, it's 24-7, and uh, basically it will go from there based on the presentation she makes with, the, with respect to our medical and with our uh, health unit. Terms of, of order conditions. And any timeline of what that might look like moving forward? No, uh, she's being uh, she's being evaluated right now. As a matter of fact, and she'll be getting complete evaluation like we do with everyone. Uh, at that point in time, they'll make a determination. But initially, she will be in the medical unit, and she will be on an eyeball watch uh, for for added precaution. And what's a day look like for her? Will she be interacting with people here? Well, right now she's going to be in the. Uh, the eyeball watch, and she's going to be alone. Uh, and when she she uh, transitions into uh, uh, the the setting itself at the, the prison, decisions will be made based on her uh, on her assessments. It is, of course, a high profile case, and it's kind of been a while since it, I guess, first blew. What kind of things do you take to factor? You know, what kind of things do you factor when you think about stuff like this? Well, basically, she's treated as everyone else that comes into uh, the Bristol County. Uh, the assessments we're making right now, both uh, uh, medical as well as mental health, are done for everyone. So based on, on where she is and, and the high profile nature of the case, right now the best situation is, at least initially, she'll be in the uh, eyeball watch, she'll be in the medical unit, and she'll be housed in the medical unit. After that, it depends on uh, where she is medically and, and mentally. And do we think that the inmates who are here right now know who she is, know she's coming, do we know anything? I, I don't know. I can't answer that. Okay. Do you know when she's eligible for parole? Like uh, no, I know she's, based on what we've seen, it's 15 months to be served out of a two and a half year serve, uh, sentence. So, not, no chance she could get out earlier oh, they, than I think I have to talk to the judge and, and her attorney on that. What am I missing? Okay. Any other notes you want to? Oh, that's really what I have. The, uh, that's about all we have. She just came in for a while, yeah. just before you. Yeah. As a matter of fact, uh, uh, matter of fact, you might have been uh, right with her when she came in. Okay. <coughs> um, let me just go further. You know what her day looks like. Uh, will her family be able to visit her at all? Right once now? the once the initial process is, is completed, uh, she will have uh, visiting hours and so forth. Will it be restricted to family only, or with, with her celebrity status? Are you expecting media or others to pop in? Well, we don't. Uh, we don't know at the present time. We are set up to to make sure that uh, that she's taken care of appropriately, and that things are done in the best interest of the department as well as her. Do you know um, how long the process usually takes? Uh, just like the initial evaluation process. It's going to be done today. The initial today. evaluation will be done today, yes. So then any time after that, her family could come visit technically? Once, once she's cleared for that, sure. And just my last question. Sure. Internet use for her? Anything like that? Um, that uh, I would not be able to comment on at the present time right now. Okay. Yeah. Anything you want to add? No. no the, uh, unfortunately, it's just right at the very beginning. I mean, you really did come in exactly the same time she did. And then she just came in uh, and one of those vans, right? Correct, that's correct, right, yeah. Straight from the top. That's correct. I mean, she just, uh, if, if you didn't come in together, she'd just beat you in. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Thank All you. Right. Thank you. Okay. Good.